swear you in. And you're only sworn in in the heat of fire. That's why you saw swear those people in at the formation. You have to come somewhere and show us you're willing to put your life on the line before you can wear that title. And once you've done that, you've been baptized by fire. You saw it. Mm -hmm. They all get the oath. Same way we have Stone Mountain. Everybody was scared, sweaty. They didn't know what was going to happen. I don't talk smack. They thought that people was going to come over the hill with sheets. And there they are over there. So now you can be sworn in. You've done it. Okay. Once that's happened, you are now sanctioned. You can go back to your neighborhood and start to do the things that we that we impress upon as our ideals. And I keep saying that's community policing. That's uh, in, in education is becoming a responsible fire on it. That's educating your people on rights. That's providing services for the community in case there's a situation. Policing the police is one of those, whether working with them or working against them. And most importantly, being in a position to be called up for a national mobilization like we did in Louisville. Those people came from all over the country. Mm -hmm. People like to say, oh, you're based in Atlanta. No, oh, no. we are not based mm -hmm. in Atlanta. And so stop. Mm -hmm. We just showed up in Georgia twice because that's where the problem was. Right. So don't sit around and start thinking that you know, the NFAC is, is, is there to come to, like, for instance, places where we cannot come unless you understand the implications. So by joining and starting a chapter in your area where you're familiar with your dynamics and your laws, it assists us in growing the coalition, for instance. I couldn't march the NFAC into Chicago because the, the gun laws of Illinois do not allow us to even open carry. We would be fighting from the plane all the way to where you were. It would be all out war with the police if we did that. So stop asking for something that you can fix while you're there. All the guns in the hood, and y'all can't stop this. All the, all the people there in that big city, and y'all can't put them together. Yes, I know they can. Chi-Town can put it together and then give us a call and we can link with them and provide assistance, but we cannot march into their town like we did in Kentucky, which is open carry, constitution, no permit, wild, wild west. Mm -hmm. We can come into a place like that, but we cannot come into places like California where open carry is banned because of the Panthers. We can't come into New York City because guns are banned. We can't march into some of these places because they've already used the law mm -hmm. to shut things down. And we've told people, you were on the steps, you heard mm -hmm. what I told them, you have the power in your hand to change the law. Then you can have the, you can have the basis for things like that. So to join, uh, like I said, those are the qualifications, the very basic age, uh, race, your affiliation with law enforcement, ex-military, um, and, and you must now, we've got some other qualifications, you must now own a certain type of weapon. We yeah. can't, you can't bring your granddad shotgun and roll his head in the back of the caddy. You know what I'm saying? The right. joint that ain't been fired since 1972. Yeah. Yeah. You know, we ain't doing that no That's more. Right? We're we not doing that no more. Um, and, and not only that, you also have to bring us proof of your last marksmanship record. Dang. That week. You can't, when last time you shot? Oh, shot last week. Let me see a sheet. Mm -hmm. And we're going to call it the range. Of, what's his brother in there? <laughs> So you can't bring nobody else and stuff. Right, nobody else else. So, you know, you can't have, you can't do that anymore. So that's how, that's how, so if you've already got an organization in your town mm -hmm. and you want to align with us, reach out to us uh, at info at blacknfac.com. Reach out to us and, move, and write out, hey, listen, this is what we've been doing. We think we align with you. Let's get in alignment. No problem. We'll reach back out to you. You know, but what we will not do is, and this is actually happening, to be honest, we will not say.